Message saved for 412 days. Oh shit! Big Boss Reggie coming through. Straight up though, man, congrats. This launch party for your startup is going to be lit. I better be reading about you taking over the world in a magazine or some shit. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Tonight better be open bar. <laughs> Message saved for 230 days. Reg, where you been, baby? I don't know if you meant to drop that in my voicemail, but you got me worried. I know the divorce went rough, so come out. Have a beer with your boy. Catch me up on you. And hey, I got a friend in town that maybe you want to chill with. I think you'd like him. He drives monster trucks. Just put it out there. All right, peace. Message saved for 65 days. Hey, I'm going to get right to it, so just be straight with me. Why am I seeing chatter about Wrench out there again? What happened to leaving all that behind? I hope you know what you're doing. Just, if you're in trouble, hit me up, all right? All right, Ratchet, there's the job. It's Wrench, Wrench. You're doing this on purpose to antagonize me. Wait a minute. Are you flirting with me, Jordy? Gonna ignore that. Job is simple, so even you'll find it hard to screw up. Client wants you to steal a car. I'm sending you the coordinates. Ew. Pass. That's boring. Sorry, Mike Ranch, but the client specifically asked for you. And, oh yeah, they, uh, they're gonna tag along on the job, too. What? Uh, I'm not some glorified babysitter. Uh, they paid a loot of crypto to ensure that today you are, so get to it. Wait. Who's asking for me? Is it a trap? Jordy? Jordy! I see you've accepted the mission. Excellent. Step one is underway. Um, for the record, I'm an unwilling participant in whatever deep throat fantasy you're acting out here, dude. Deep what? That's gross, man. No, it, it's an X-Files thing. I, you're gross. Whatever you say. The car I want you to steal should be nearby. Who the fuck are you? And why are you using a voice modulator? Ask the guy who's also using a voice modulator. Get the car, and maybe you'll find out. God, it's making my eyes bleed. I love it. Wait a minute. That music? This car? Are you? Oh my god. Don't tell me. You can't be! You know it, baby. It's the epic Wrench and Marcus crossover the people have been asking for. Marcus? Marcus! Ah, oh, shit. That's almost better than what I thought. Wait, who the fuck did you this? I won't lie. I was kind of hoping you were Jimmy Siska. <laughs> no, but I do have a surprise planned for you in that vein. This car is the car Jimmy Siska drives in the upcoming Devin Von Devin movie. Devin v. Devin. London Culling. Oh my god! Is Jimmy Siska gonna jump out of the trunk? No, Reggie, you're killing me here. Drop to these coordinates and I'll fill you in. Alright, so first off, you going AWOL without a word to your boy was rude. You're gonna apologize to me later for making me worry about your stupid ass. Yes, Mom. Now, tell me what my surprise is. Please, please, please! So remember when that teaser for Devin v. Devin London Culling dropped? Finally, Devin Von Devin was gonna return to our screens, facing off against his evil British clone, Devin Van Devin, in an epic showdown of Devins. Yeah, but after the London bombings, filming got shut down and they couldn't finish the movie. Yeah, they were missing a few big stunts, but the car and all the sets are still here. Oh my God, you don't mean. It's up to us. We're gonna film those stunts and finish the movie. Fuck yeah, we are! In a world in need of a hero, one man stands in the way of humanity's destruction. Jimmy Siska returns as Devin Vaughn Devin. I am back, baby. In his directorial debut, Siska brings Devin Von Devin to the merry streets of England, 
where he faces off against his greatest adversary yet. I think you're seeing double. His clone, secretly grown from his DNA by the sinister spy agency Elite Shadow Force, Devin Van Devin. How can I defeat myself? Huh. The epic showdown is coming soon in Devin V. Devin, London Calling. Oh, shit! That sounds so good! I am at half-mast! what we're about to do here? I see a ramp, I see a car, and if the answer isn't, we're gonna jump a car, I'm never speaking to you again. Hell yeah, we're gonna jump a fucking car. yippee ki motherfucker! Yeah, I got a nice angle on that too. That, uh, that, that, that car's not insanely expensive or anything, right? I'm sure it'll buff out. We've got some more shots to do. Let's roll. Ranch and his BFF Marcus Going to blow stuff up, yeah, yeah Going to Cyber 2 Driver Gonna be friends with Jimmy Stiska Okay, it's Wrench again, huh? So how did you know I was in London? <laughs> Just been talking to everybody doesn't mean I didn't keep tabs on you After you split with He who must not be named And can fall down a well Yeah, touchy subject, I know I won't put you on blast for it, just are you all right? What are you doing here? I had unfinished business with Rampart. Remember that, asshole? But right now, I'm gonna blow some stuff up and live out my Devin Von Devin fan fiction, and it's gonna be so epic. Hey, he's back. Let's light it up. Okay, this is the part of the movie where Devin clashes with Devin in their first big action set piece. A showdown of epic proportions. I can do a bigger boom. Let me have fireworks, please. Hey, you gotta run through and arm all the explosives that are set up. You need to be fast, though. If you take too long, they'll automatically disarm as a safety precaution. Speed run! a little. Every time I think I'm used to you. Okay, I want star wipes on this, Marcus. We're making art here.
coming soon in the next chapter of the Devon Von Devon saga. You're not the man I thought you were, Devon. That's because it wasn't me. It was Devon, my evil clone. He has been using my fingerprints to fool the scanner. He has my fingerprints. He is me. Face it, Devon. You're being replaced by a superior version. I don't think so. Nothing beats American made. Hey man, do you think there's a chance that Devon v. Devon, London Culling, could end with Devon Von Devon losing? What? No way. There is literally nothing that can take Devon Von Devon down. Except for himself? Huh? Why else did they clone him? Who wins in a death match between Jimmy Siska and Jimmy Siska? It's, it's an impossible riddle! But his clone is not the same as him. It's not actually Devin versus himself. It's like Alien versus Predator. You know who's going to win. Oh, fuck. Not this again. The Xenomorph has acid blood, Marcus. It melts through the Predator's armor. Nah, fuck you. The Predator has a stealth cloak and thermal vision and fucking rocket launchers. The Predator is the greatest hunter in the galaxy. The Xenomorph is just big game. I am turning this car around, young man. Oh shit, where'd the knockoff Cylons come from? They're Rampart bots. Man, how do I get this guy off my ass? Well, they look angry and armed. Hey, let's get out of here. Maybe we can find a different place to set up. No way. I'm not letting Rampart take Devin Von Devin away from me, too. The show must go on. The area is secure. Route patrol pro. Power supply overheating. Power charges on blast. Initializing ultrasonic blast. Target down. Extreme internal temperature. Ultrasonic blast charging. Cooling systems restored. You want me to order you some? Drone will get here in just a few minutes. Marcus, you're ruining my moment. Woohoo! That's the money shot. Aw, oh, I guess there are robots in Devin v. Devin now. Hell yeah, dude. This is like a punch up to the script. Maybe we'll get writing credits for improving the third act. <laughs> you know, I can see us looking fresh as hell on the red carpet premiere. All units, all units, proceed to alarm location. Acknowledge, over. Perfect. I got all the footage we needed. I'm gonna cut this together and send it to Jimmy Siska's crew. And you'll add Star Wipes? And a banger soundtrack. I got you, Reggie. I'm sorry. The <laughs> wrench. Eh, you can get away with it. You coming home soon? Um, maybe. I've still gotta do some stuff here. All right. But when you get your scrawny ass back to San Fran, hit me up. Everybody's been waiting to do a full crew hangout on the beach. Now, I won't lie, Sitara might want to chew your ear off for a bit. But it's with love, right? You know, that does sound nice. Thanks, man.
You're buying, though. Am I? It, just hurry up over there, all right? And once we get this movie out the door, you better not watch the new trailer without me. Mark it in your calendar. You, me, Devin, and Devin. I love you, man. I know. Give him the Albion treatment.